Lucy. Um, I taught my friends at school how to draw penguins. I'm going to show you two different ways to draw penguins and then you can make them. I had my friends, they wanted to do both ways, so they did. And I want to add yours to our board at school. So um, I'm going to show you two different ways to draw a penguin. All right. I only have a blue marker that works right now, so I'm going to use blue. But usually I would use black because penguins are black and white, right? All right. So I'm going to first draw the body. It is an oval, a big oval. It kind of looks like an egg, doesn't it? And then I'm going to draw an oval inside of the oval. So you have two ovals, one inside the other. And then the arms, they are triangles coming out of the side. They're not arms, they're flippers, right? Penguins have flippers. And then when I do the um, feet, I just make kind of like a W and then make an extra line. It's like upside down W. And I do it on the other side too. And then for his beak, I do a triangle, upside down triangle. And then his eyes. And then I give him some hair up here too, sometimes, if you want to. So that's my penguin. And then I would color in with black all around. Not the inside though, because then that would be coloring his, um, the white part of him. We don't want to do that. So I would color it all in, and then I would use orange for his beak and for his flippers to color in. And then this is another way I draw penguins. It's a circle for its head at the top. And then I kind of make like a heart shape on the inside, like that. And then for his body, I just do another oval connecting and then I do triangles for its, its flippers. And then the same kind of feet. I just do like the W, but I make an upside down W. Oop, 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 just like that. And I also put white on the inside here. And then we have his beak, which is an upside down triangle again his eyes and then I give him some hair on top sometimes you don't have to if you don't want to you could also if you want to take this part and make a line like that so it looks like he has a you know his beak comes apart for his mouth and then you can color it in like that and then with the black you can color in all around and color his flippers. So I hope you have fun making penguins. The friends at school did, and I would love to add yours to our board at school. So when you're done, have your mom take a picture of your penguins. Bye.